you had a bunch of journalists going and talking to whoever the quarterback was, and you were kind of the guy who would talk to the you right. know second string O lineman about talk what's going on. You built these but relationships it was also, that are amazing. When I walked walked in that giant locker room in 1993, I didn't have the education of everybody else. I had no experience, um, and I, you know, I looked in there and I said, "Man, how could I be different?" I want people to really get this here. How could I be different? And you know, most people are afraid to be different. They want to be a face in the crowd. So I said, okay, these guys, they're going to work 40 hours a week. I'm going to work 100 hours a week. And which screwed me up. I was making 9,700 bucks a year living in New York City. And Strahan would drop, feel bad for me and drove me back in the city every single day because <laughs> yeah, I didn't have enough that. money for subway and bus fare. And one day I offered to pay my rent and I jumped his shit over it. I'm like, no, I'll take free rides, but I'm not taking money. And um, I got all the players to kind of understand my plight. And so I said, man, I'm going to outwork them by, you know, double. And how could I be different? I felt they were using their pen as a weapon. Well, I was going to start relationships. 